Hey everybody, it's me Dave, Something Fishy, somethingfishyinc.net, located in Cleveland, Ohio, and uh, just give me a quick look at um, my other project. This is um, now going to be my office, this is uh, my property, a unit of mine, so um, I'm making this my uh, Something Fishy World Headquarters. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, so this is, I'm going to call the Aqua Lounge, which is like the living room. I got that custom 100 gallon corner tank. I'm going to get ready to clean that out, get that prepped and ready. Then I get a 44, 45, 50 gallon, another corner tank that's going to go there. And then that tank, I'm not sure yet. I don't think that would stay in there. I got lots of options. Um, pulling some tanks out of the showroom in the store when I start moving the store to the other building. Um, then I got more options, more custom tanks I've had. I keep them because there's a tube tank back there. I got another tube tank I can probably bring over. Um, and uh, yeah, I don't get rid of them because the cost to replace them would be very expensive. So I'm gonna utilize them. So I don't sell too many acrylics anymore. Um, they're very cost. Um, costly and uh, one of the bad things about acrylic they scratch easy the cost and they scratch easy um, there's some benefits obviously with them but this is my my office um, I gotta work on there's me mirrors that's gonna be for the dojo so yep and the hallway and this is gonna be the next person's office it's gonna be in there for doing an internet business internet sales then I have another room, there's gonna be a tank there, and just a stock room, maybe like a library or something, because I got tons of fish books, magazines for like 40 years of stuff, or more, longer. So, yep, there's gonna be a tank in there, probably on that wall, not sure. Maybe I'll let the person that's gonna be working in that office um, pick their tank. I'll give them a couple options, and I'll go from there. This is what is the dining room which is actually going to be the media room. It has the old original built-in cabinet, the stained LED, uh, lead glass. Old school, real wood, good stuff like they built in the old days. We got some touching up and cleaning up to still do. I redid the wood floors. And um, this is going to be the backdrop. I'm getting a custom wrap that will be our backdrop for doing YouTube, maybe podcast. I got a lot of ideas, a lot of plans. There's a lot. Um, just not enough time today. Um, some things are in the work, so uh, the future looks good. It just it's taking longer than I like. I wish I could just snap my fingers and it'd be done. But yeah, I haven't had that barber chair as my my seat, whatever, and then uh, maybe a table of some sort. I'm not sure. We'll see, we'll have to figure it out, see what people like, we could change it up. Backdrop would be cool, and this is gonna be like the media room, I'm calling it. So, yeah, it'd be nice. Kitchen needs uh, some work, clean up. I got all new ceiling fans, new ceilings. I've done a lot of work in here, put some money in the place. So it'll be a nice place to hang out, talk fish, talk business, meetings, um, and get away from the shop part and I can get some work done um, in other ways so but I just want to give you a heads up give you the ideas give a look around actually we could go check the store out real quick so I already did the bathroom this hallway I gotta get a new fridge so there's a lot going on the basement Shoe. And there goes so access to the this is H1. So and the stock room. I try to get organized is like seems impossible, but not here in the store. So it's gonna be great addition. Just a quick looky. That tank's gonna get broke down soon. Oh check this out. Severum's got a big batch of eggs again. They spawn turquoise in the red spot. That's a bi-level. That'll go into the new space. That's probably going to go in my office. 
that 100 gallon flatback hex. I might leave it just like that. I was gonna maybe switch it up, put something else in it, but it's kind of cool, different. And I could use the images, videos, and pictures to show people, give them an idea, different looks. This tank's gonna go, it's sold probably. Um, I got a new setup that's gonna go in the shop. This one, I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it. There's my puffer. I'm gonna have a whole new display. I'm gonna do one of these 32 gallon flex as a new uh, Congo puffer and um, Congo display tank. But yep, yeah, this tank is going in the media room, which is the dining room. I probably won't keep those fish, I don't think. Um, koi and goldfish, the pond season, then the shop, of course. There's Poco. So, yep. Lots of stuff. I'm trying to do a quick one. I got I got plenty of work to do. Plenty of work. B2, the upper cichlid. It's about two foot. Lots of nice fish. Shelly's, comps, Cressips, Calvis, Julie's. Maybe Lupi's. Bella Sharks, Red Severums, some nice balls of money, rainbows, geos, some Central Americans. There's a wall tank looking for food. And here, back to me, my mug shot. But all right, uh, remember what we feed and promote extreme foods, good stuff. All right, I gotta go. Y'all take care. I appreciate you guys subscribing, liking, and why did I have, whoops, hit a button. Somebody's trying to message me. So, all right, I got to go. I got a meeting today. Hopefully get something concrete down, get the flooring put in and the opening. There's some cool effects I'm going to do in the new uh, showroom at the new building. So, when it's all said and done, it's taking longer, but it's going to be cool. So, stay tuned. I appreciate it. Subscribe, like, share. Hit that bell, you know, all that drive you hear from everybody. So, all right, y'all take care. I'm out. Bye.